Making sense of your money with the stock market in trouble, millions of people are pulling out of their investments, but that's not the case for the state of Arizona. As ABC 15's Dave Bisping explains, the treasurer's office trades billions of taxpayer dollars every day. We're one of the larger banks in the state that nobody's heard of. Every day, the state treasurer's office handles billions of dollars. But what you may not know is the office also trades that money on the New York Stock Exchange. It's not a sleepy little office like you would normally uh, think. Martin and his small team of day traders manage tax funds for the state and about 140 other local governments. Add it up, and that means they invest between one and two billion dollars a day. We pull it all together, and then we go out there and, and get and invest it. The treasurer's office hasn't always operated this way. In fact, just a few years ago, there wasn't a trading team, just a phone and fax machine to invest state money. It was like 1970s technology. But it has come a long way since Martin took office, and he's wired his workers to the market, something that's paying off in a big way. This last fiscal year that ended in June, uh, we made and distributed over half a billion dollars in profits. Those profits go back in Arizona's general fund. And while it might sound dangerous to have the state trade our tax money in the volatile market, Martin and his team promise it's safe. My philosophy is safety first then liquidity, and only finally yield. That's the last criteria we look at, not the first one. Dave Biscobing, ABC 15 News.